Well, guys, it's pretty rainy here. Looks like the tides are turning and it's turning into fall here in upstate New York. I moved some of my marigolds here. I don't know if they're going to make it or not. I took them out of that barrel in the front, which has some bulbs and mums and things. It looks a little junky, but who knows, by the end of fall, it may look gorgeous, or I might just have to unload it for next year. Here comes the truck. <laughs> So we've just been busy getting things situated here. Um, appointments, summer, and uh, all that type of thing. There comes the rain off the roof. And there's still goldfish in that barrel. We're going to move them to the pond. The bees, they're just relaxing. We have more hives. All our bees, well, I can't say all of our bees. Bees, a lot of our bees. Um, all these guys are alive, and our other really tall hives are good. I think the less you mess with them, the happier they are. We don't insulate them and all that stuff. And we're in New York. I think sometimes people overkill bees, and then they, you know, too much love. Think about how they live in nature. Slow and steady wins the race, guys. Don't be in a big hurry. You want to keep these. Okay, guys. So remember, big or small, you too can be a backyard farm. God bless.